Hey guys, I'm gonna try this again. A lot of times my phone screws up, so I don't get to upload any videos. Um, but yeah, here we go. Welcome back to Retro Asylum. I stopped at Goodwill. Let's see what I checked out, what, what I got. And I think I tried to do a video like this before, and I didn't show you. So I'm heavy in the toys right now. I, I went to the bins about, let's just say I started going to the bins in Greenwood, Indiana. And um, I really like hit a lot of McDonald's Happy Meal toys. It, one time and I found about every other time I found a toy or a small item that people are not paying attention to that I could flip for almost $20. I had a little transformer toy sold for like 18, 19 bucks that I, I found. Uh, so I've been paying attention to them. So in this one, I mean, these grab bags. So I love these grab bags. I love toys. I love vintage toys. So in here, is there a stain on there? There might be a stain on the, it's not the animal. Um, but there is, let's see if I can get this here. Snoopy, looks like a Funko Pop. Play-Doh, disregard to Play-Doh. There's a Snoopy little figure in there too. What else is there? I think that's it. But the Funko and the sealed stuffed animal, which I don't know if I made a good buy on that. Hopefully it's just the plastic that's dirty. Um, but we'll see. If, if not, donate it back. Funko Pop, might be worth some money. Snoopy, didn't want to look it up. We'll see. Second grab bag had, it has a bunch of vintage uh, things. It has a Tarzan, Tarzan toy. Uh, tar, was it Tarzan? See, so kind of the head of him. There's a parrot, don't know which order that's from. Um, there's a Goofy in here somewhere. Goofy somewhere. You can see it probably, his, his nose sticking out right there. Hunchback of Notre Dame, what else is in here? Um, there's a dude with a motorcycle. Can you see that? That dude with a motorcycle? Don't know what he's from. There's a hyena from the Lion King in there. See? Don't know what that's going for. And there's something else in there. That looked like a pretty good one, though. Pick that one up. There's four of these I got. And I hate to pay the money. Okay, here, this is the one I was kind of like skeptical. Skeptical. There's a big Batman right there. The orange with the orange on it. Um, there's a Batmobile car thingy. I don't know if it's... All together is a little ninja thing. There's a couple of Maginex figures. There is a Green Hornet guy. There's Rhino. And there's some junky cars that are probably not worth anything. There's a Thomas the Train in there. That was another selling point. And some of the cars look kind of funky, so I don't know if they're worth anything or not. But you never know. And, and what I do with these, if, if something is garbage, I just donate it back. Now, this one was a good one. This one was kind of hard to put down because there's a Bart Simpson in here. It has wear on it. I do see wear, but there is also, I don't know what that's from, but there's this purple card thing. You probably only can't see it very well, but I'm not sure what that is. There's a couple Pokemon, McDonald's, Happy Meal toys. There is, I don't know what that is. There's, there's a dude and a baby, a wolf thing. I don't know what that's from. I know what it's from, but I don't know what it's from. Maybe from Animaniacs, I'm not sure. Um, don't know what that is. A whistle, definitely not keeping that. There's some squishy stuff. I don't like to sell that. I'll look it up, see if it's worth anything. There's a Hot Wheel that looks like it has red wheels. You never know about those. I thought that was that one. It could be the other one. There's some other stuff in here too. I know there's another Happy Meal toy. There's something in here that I saw that was profitable. Okay, then we get to the books. Then we get to the books. This one I got for my son. Hopefully, if he doesn't like it, I'll sell it online. It's probably not worth much, but that'd be interesting. I'll have him read it. Chasing Lincoln's Killer. I thought he might get a kick out of it, so pick that up for him. I had some other books picked out. I had a Paddington book. I had the Runaway Mouse uh, series. This one I'm not going to pick up. It's a wrestling deep. Eh, I might pick it up. I'm so afraid the DVDs are going to fall out. I got this. Five bucks. Five bucks. And I just realized that the price is going to be a problem. I made a stick a sticker over that and sell it. Um, but this right here, it's all over the place. But I'm probably going to stick $15 on it, try to make 10 bucks on it. And, it. and plus, it's in good condition. I kind of had to just let it sit in goodwill. This, I have no idea if it's worth any money, but it's a comic book. Backwards manga style, whatever. So I figured it might be worth something. So that's what I picked up. I had, like I said, I had the other books. I'm into vintage books, too, as well right now. So I figured, you know, I would pick up some books. I had another DVD as well. I put it back because I don't want to spend a whole lot of money. A lot of times I average about 20 bucks every time I go to Goodwill. 
Because what I find, I didn't get any clothes this time. I, I need to stay away from clothes for a little bit until I start selling the ones I got. Uh, I'm not getting big into clothes, but my storage space is getting overrun. I gotta start listing what I have. I have a decent amount of clothes right now. I need to start liquidating them somehow. Either putting them in lots, put them on Listia, do something with them just to get them out of there. Um, but yeah, there you go. I gotta get home. I've been doing Instacart and Grub, can you see it? Grub Hub all day. And made a decent amount, but I didn't make as much as I wished I would. Anyways, Retro Asylum, a lot of stuff going on. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hopefully I get to upload this video. It's going to be a short video, but it's the point. Um, thirsty as crap, had a pop, my teeth are coming loose. It's what it is. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, tell me if I snoozed on these or did I get something that, that's going to sell these. I know a lot of people think Happy Meal toys are... Me, me, me. But I've been scoring pretty good on them. And I mean, for everything that I buy, normally it's about 25 to 50 cents in to the item. And I sell it for usually about 350 or more. So it's actually not bad. It's worth my time. And I list everything at $4.99. And then I just wait for somebody to make me an offer. And then I sell it. That's pretty much what I do. Uh, so. Sometimes I'll hit big and something will be worth more. Sometimes I, you know, will sit on the item. And there's a lot of items I'm probably going to end up getting rid of soon. Uh, but yeah, uh, like, comment, subscribe, all the good jazz. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. More will be coming soon. I think I fixed the camera on the phone, so we'll see. We'll see. See you later. Keep rocking. Keep on watching YouTube. Hopefully a little bit more of me.